back. I had to accidentally cut there for a second, guys, because I accidentally showed the cords. But looking out onto this side of the mountain, so I can see the cow valley down here, the grasslands over there. This is where I want to put my tower. I think it's going to be really neat. So we need to go ahead and mark this area. Firstly, I'm going to cut down this tree because it's kind of in the way of everything. Just a little. Let's see. Can we get this guy? Where is the rest of this wood here? You're done. Is that the whole tree? I can't tell if that's the whole tree. Let's see. Is that it? I think that's it. What do we got? What do we got going here? Anything? I think that's it. So we can actually... Okay, here we go. Now we can block this off like so. Looking good. And this is going to be the general area for my uh, wizard tower. I think this could look really good. So let's dig away. Let's get rid of this grass here because this just kind of gets in the way at this point. And we're going to begin marking off an area. Now, I probably made a little too many fences because I'm just going to make one just kind of to show that back here is where I'm going to be building my tower. The one thing is how big do we want to make it? Like, I understand that like we can probably take it out here. We can go like if we break all of this. We can go like right about here and we can put up a bit of a fence post and we can block it on all sides here. Wizard Tower, it's not going to be too big. It's going to go underground as well. So keep that in mind, guys, when you're looking at the whole design of this. We can go out like this. So these will be the two blockages for blockades for where we're going to be putting everything. Let me and then inside I'll get rid of all these um, all the grass and everything. That way it all looks good. But here, we're going to label this sign right here saying spot claimed for Linky. There we go. And then in here as well, just so no one thinks they can kind of push their way into here. Spot claimed by Linky. Perfect. Alex is on. Perfect. So we have a little area set up now. It's looking good. Spot... I, I, under I lowercase that C that's gonna bug me in the end but we have that all done which is really awesome so hopefully we're gonna be able to start building in this I think that could be really fun and then I'm gonna take a shovel over to here in a second and then we're gonna kind of lay out everything make sure everything works out the way I want it to I think this is a big enough area to build my tower also it's not gonna be a square tower like I usually do with stuff like this it's gonna be circular I'm gonna pull up probably planet minecraft has a lot of awesome, like, PDF resources where I can see, like, perfect circle designs in Minecraft and stuff like that. Stuff where I can make it odd number, an odd-numbered design. And there goes Alex. So I can make, like, an odd-numbered design that way I can actually, like, make a single door going in. Stuff like that. So those are my plans right now. Let me, do, let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below of the idea for building kind of, like, a wizarding tower we're going to have to do is we're going to have to extend this pathway all the way over to where the tower is going to be. It's a little bit off from the general settlement area that we have right now for the group. But I think it'll work out in the end. Cows! The sounds are just rude. It's rude and not nice to me. Because I'm recording and you guys are you guys are interrupting. You know what we're going to do? We're going to end up turning your mob sounds. Those are hostile creatures. Friendly creatures all the way down. That we, we don't even have to hear you. But that's my plan right now for everything that's going to be happening. I'm really excited about it. Let me know in the comments what you guys think about building a wizarding tower. Think Harry Potter meets ancient Greece, and you'll have the design that I'm thinking of right now. Again, lapis. Does he have any lapis? That's enchanted books. Rares, maybe? No. Goods, farming, dirt, sugarcane, decorative blocks. Does he have a gemstone chest or anything like that? Bone blocks. I'm gonna borrow this quickly. What the heck is a bone block? Can you can you take it back? Is it That's so weird. Is it like Is it literally just made out of bones? Hang on. I wanna take a look at this quickly. Look at that! Would you look- I'm gonna take a screenshot of that. Would you look at that? There is such thing as a bone block in Minecraft now? I didn't even know they added that. Did they add that in 1.9 or in 1.10? I don't even know, man. That's just kind of crazy. Do you have any lapis? Any at all? 
You don't seem to. Goodies. I don't think he'll mind if I take a single piece of lapis. CM, would you would you do you mind? I just want to enchant one of my items here. I want to see if we can get something good to end off the episode. And then next episode you'll see the beginning of the framework for the tower. Let's see. Do we want let's, let's see if we can enchant the pickaxe. There we go. Efficiency two. What do we get on the sword? Unbreaking two. Knockback. What about on the axe? We get like efficiency or something? Efficiency two on the axe could be good. Silk touch! Unbreaking 2, Efficiency 2. That's pretty good. I gotta say, that is pretty good. That means we get grass blocks back. That's neat. I like that a lot. And that didn't break. Awesome. So we have a Silk Touch Diamond Axe now, which is pretty cool. I think that's gonna be the perfect way to end off today's episode, guys. If you all enjoyed this episode of the Theta SMP server, please be sure to leave a rating in the comment set a rating and leave a comment in the comment section down below. What do you think of the Wizard Tower idea? What do you think of our progress on the wall and everything? And what do you think of this axe? Because I want to know, is this a good, like, gathering axe? Because I know you can also make battle axes now, because diamond axes do more than diamond swords, which is kind of crazy, but they have a longer reload time. So let me know what you guys think. I'll be sure to look at your feedback. And actually, before we end off the episode... You know what? No, no, no. Cut that. Before, we're not going to end off the episode just yet. I want to go ahead, and this is just one single recording. There's so much I wanted to discuss in this episode, so I didn't want to break it up and kind of split it apart and cut it all. One thing that I want to check out that we haven't seen yet is this thing over here. I literally saw this a couple hours ago, thought nothing of it. I don't know whose this is. I don't know what they're building up here, if there's even any, any structures up here at all. But I just want to see for myself, what do we have going over here? What? on earth is this and how do you get in and can i get in let's see we might have oh that's a problem that's not fun at all we just god dang it gosh darn it that was just not fun i'm gonna cut till i get back up there guys okay we're here i'm gonna i'm slowly making my way down to the site i can make that jump right i can get all my junk back Ooh, that could have been bad. I just want to get the boots. <laughs> we can dig over here. Sorry if I'm breaking this. Whose is this? Right. How the hell did you get over here? I don't even know. I'm not going to ask. I'm not going to ask why you're secluding yourself from us. I think he hates us, guys. The fake Canadian hates us. It's not good. Oh, drop mistake. There we go. So this is Rise Space. All right. So anyway, guys, that is actually going to be the end of the episode. Second death on the server now. That just sucks. Anyway, guys, if you all enjoyed today's episode, do what I said before. And as always, I've been Linky, and we'll see you all in the next video. Peace.